still doing Tech Love Live from Open Source Bridge, and I'm joined by Evan Podromo. Podromo. Yeah. Okay. So you're uh, at Evan on Identica. Yes, that's okay. me. Okay. And where can we find you otherwise online? Uh, you can find me Evan Podromo on Twitter, um, or. Fada um, <gasps> lie. <laughs> I am on Twitter. Yeah, it's kind of funny. I, I, I used to have um, I used to have Evan on Twitter. Mm -hmm. um, Evan oh. Williams, who's the the CEO of Twitter, like he, he gave me Evan because he used to have it and he said I'm not using it, so he gave it to me. And then I started Identica, and uh, they hired another guy named Evan at Twitter. I'm like, hey, you can have this back. So oh. I've got my own name back, back nice there. Uh, well, <laughs> I mean, I wasn't using it. The poor yeah. guy had like at underscore heaven. Anyways. Oh, no, no. Okay, so um, you gave the, a talk this morning. And That's we right. actually streamed the talk about Laconica. Yeah. So can you tell us a little bit about that and how it went? Uh, yeah, so I thought the, the talk actually went really well. I mean, it's really, you know, anytime you're talking about something that, that matters a lot to you and you're, you're feeling like completely immersed in, it's really hard to linear, linearize it into, you know, a number of slides and go from step A to step B. I just want to talk about everything at once. Mm -hmm. But uh, uh, I, I feel like I'm getting to the point where I can actually talk about this, uh, this, this site and the software and, and, and the process. Um, you know, uh, the, I, I think that this is a particularly receptive crowd, um, you know, uh, especially here in Portland with the uh, you know high use of Twitter a lot of microblogging a lot of people here are really interested and it's, I know it really unifies the uh, Portland technology community um, but it's also a very open source aware um, city and we're here at the open source bridge so uh, I think it was just very receptive and a good you know conjunction of those two things so um, one of the notes you made here is why open source for microblogging why does it work so well yeah um, I think that uh, you know Microblogging is really about networks and about making connections and, and sharing information across uh, across networks. And uh, you know the the biggest network that we have is the web. Mm -hmm. And the um, best way to publish anything on the web is using open source software. You know we have so many great open source uh, CMSs or open source web servers. Uh, so I think that open source in combination with microblogging is very natural using the web as as how we connect our social network. So um, I think that uh, it's a, it, as microblogging becomes more and more important to people's lives, I think that an open source implementation and open source connected distributed network becomes more and more um, uh, important and, and, and relevant. So it becomes not just um, a tool, it becomes part yeah. of your life. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I think that all of us have, have things we want to share with people that we that we know, that we care about, people in our families or, or with work or um, just in our community. And, uh, you know, sharing those tidbits of information um, is, uh, you know, becoming more and more of the way we live our life online and off. And uh, so I think that uh, having control over that um, putting it into your own domain or putting it into uh, uh, something that you control and letting it go out over the over the internet through the web um, in a way that you have a little bit of uh, uh, of control over is, is is very important. So, and I think that's really what an open source implementation can do. Yeah. And so, our our last note, and I know a little bit about your travels because. People talk. Um, how are your travels? <laughs> My travels are going good. I'm really glad to be here. I, um, I just love being in Portland. I think this is a, like one of the greatest cities um, in the world. Woo, go Portland! Um, and uh, it's I, I'm. This is my. Uh, Fifth city on this particular like junket, um, mm -hmm. and it's been uh, it's been pretty uh, pretty fun uh, being on the road. I, I, I brought my wife and kids this time, so we've been uh, we've been having a pretty good time. So, um, and uh, it's a uh, it, it's a, always hard to leave home, especially you know in the summer uh, summertime in my hometown of Montreal is is always the best time to be there, mm -hmm. but uh, it, it's also nice to be, you know, getting energized by so many communities in different uh, cities who are excited about what's going on on the web right now. How long are you in Portland? Uh, I'm here till Saturday. Till Saturday? Yeah. Very cool. So you're first week. Well, it was yeah. really, really good talking to you. It's nice to meet you. Thanks, Thanks a so lot. Thanks so much for coming up. Okay. Thank you. Bye.